The baddest woman on the planet is here. There is only one. Rowdy Ronda Rousey. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Venice Beach, California, the Raw Women's Champion, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Listen to this place. They're going nuts. Look who's here. Time for a little twin magic. And her partners, Nikki Bella and Brie Bella, the Bella Twins. Byron, this isn't total Bellas. This is the real deal. I'm still happy to see the Bellas, two of the most successful tandems in WWE history. They're actually only one tandem, Saxton. It takes more than one person to make a tandem. You know what I meant. Yeah, two sisters who have had almost parallel success here in WWE, both former women's champions, Divas champion. And what's cool to me, guys, is that despite the long road and long career here in WWE, the Bellas will tell you their bond is stronger than ever. They have their own reality show, Byron's favorite, Total Bellas. How come you guys never come over when I want to watch it? We don't like you. in WWE. Yeah, no question about that. Antics aside, three very talented ladies. Plenty on the line here in this huge three-on-three -three matchup. Sit back and enjoy, guys. It's not every day you get this. Look at this, Byron. She's almost out of it. No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. Her back is in some real pain now. She's in a bad way now. She's taking on some offense here. And the confidence she came into this six women's tag team match seems to be fading a bit. Hey, when you put Ouch. six of the most competitive women on the roster today in the same ring at the same time, somebody's gonna get hurt. And it just so happens to be her. She's looked off her game almost all night here, guys. And to be honest, Oof. I'm a little surprised. Sometimes you'll see a smile on Ronda Rousey's face, but that changes once she goes into combat mode, Corey. <laughs> Call the cops when Ronda's on the loose. She'll tell you she's not a wrestler or a fighter. Ronda's a martial artist. Her judo training means she puts out maximum efficiency with minimum effort. There's a philosophy, purpose, and direction in everything she does. 
Byron, Corey described Ronda's judo philosophy with her extensive combat background. How does her past translate to competition in WWE? Well, Rousey is learning that her skills can make her a dominant force in WWE, but she still has to remember that there are moves she's never felt in an octagon and rules that make those moves perfectly legal as well. Look out. There are instances when a six-man tag match will feature a team where superstars have not always seen eye to eye or are in the midst of a disagreement. When that's the case, someone on the team must step up and be the voice of reason so the trio can function as a cohesive unit. Corey, earlier you talked about what needs to happen when members of a six-man team have differences or had differences in the past. If the team can't find a way to get on the same page, they will not last very long. Look out, there's the tag. And that changes the entire outlook for these women, Michael. Drop by a clothesline. She makes it look easy. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. Thanks to Raw General Manager Kurt Angle in May of 2017, the WWE Universe saw a dream team come together when the Hardy Boys joined forces with the lunatic fringe Dean Ambrose. The exciting trio took on Sheamus, Cesaro, and The Miz. Truth be told, both Miz and Ambrose blended in with their impromptu tag team partners pretty well. Byron, we always make a point to talk about continuity amongst team members. In the six-man match, where Dean Ambrose teamed with the Hardys against Sheamus Cesaro and The Miz, both teams worked very well together. That surprised me, since this was the first time they teamed together. But there was something that night about the lunacy of Dean Ambrose fitting perfectly with the Daredevil Hardy Boys. I've got to say, I had goosebumps for a week. After Here comes Brie Bella. Plants an E right on her face. She's in firm control of this one. The night could be over for Liv Morgan. In 2016, the New Day found themselves in the middle of a sick and twisted rivalry with the Wyatt family. Things escalated to the point where Bray Wyatt invited the New Day to do battle at the Wyatt family compound. New Day accepted, but what followed was something no one expected or will ever be able to forget. Look at her go! Corey, we've talked about six-man tag matches, and earlier you talked about one that Liv Morgan sizing it up. Unbelievable move by Liv Morgan. She's dominating now. How is Brie Bella going to remain alive? And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Comes in off the tag. You know, despite Ronda's rigorous training at the Performance Center and continuous improvement in the ring, there was a time when Ronda Rousey felt she couldn't call herself a WWE superstar yet, like she didn't earn it, Byron. Well, her outlook changed quickly. Liv Morgan sizing it up. Look at this. Here's her chance. But now, can Liv Morgan capitalize? Again, she ended here. The pin's broken up. I can't believe it. You fellas bringing up Ronda Rousey's first women's championship win reminded me of all the naysayers that have doubted it. Let me tell you, the worst bet to make is to doubt Ronda Rousey. But Corey, those that said she can't only dare her to be great. That so-called overhyped and overrated rookie was fueled to become the Raw Women's Champion in only the third match of her career. Witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. Ronda Rousey is, of course, one of the most famous athletes in the world. More so, she's one of the most famous stars in the world. And she got that way by beating people up and taking their arm. The officials should be all over this. Adding to what Michael said about Ronda being a huge star, 
when she entered the WWE, that bright light and media attention that follows her really brought a spotlight to the women's evolution and its superstars. Yeah, you'll get a lot of publicity, a lot of notoriety from stepping into Ronda's spotlight. But touching fists, that's different. It's always fun to go to the zoo until you fall into the lion's den. Rousey, case in point. Well, she wants this win bad. Rebell in a very difficult spot here. She really needs to think about making a tag, guys. Oh. This woman has absolutely no quit in her, guys. Taking on a little offense like this isn't going to end her night. I can assure you of that. This is not where she wants to be right now. She's dangerously close to losing this thing. But then again, so is her opponent. What a match. She is on fire. You can tell by the look in her eye that Ray Bella is preparing to end this match right now. She's got her now. I knew it was only a matter of time. Very impressive, but is it enough to end it here? Brie Bella looking to end this. Yes, Mark! But is it enough to end it? What an amazing six-man tag match. Let's take another look at these ladies going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match as entertaining and action-filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match as entertaining and action-filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. Here are your winners. Rowdy Roger Rousey, Nikki Bella, and Brie Bella. Brie Bella helping catapult the team to victory. Any way you slice it, that win right there is beyond important. Matches like that are the reason why I love this job so much.